Cold water therapy, also known as cold water immersion, has exploded in popularity. From ice baths to cold showers, people are embracing the chill for its purported health benefits. But does science support the hype? Let's dive in and find out. The practice of cold exposure dates back centuries, often used for therapeutic and spiritual purposes. Modern science is now starting to understand the mechanisms behind these age-old practices. Research suggests that cold water therapy can indeed have a positive impact on both our physical and mental well-being. When you immerse yourself in cold water, your body undergoes a series of physiological changes. These changes are not just superficial, but deeply impact various systems within your body, leading to a cascade of reactions that can have both immediate and long-term effects. Blood vessels constrict, reducing blood flow to the skin and extremities. This process, known as vasoconstriction, is your body's way of preserving heat by limiting the amount of blood that reaches the surface of your skin, thereby reducing heat loss. This vasoconstriction helps to conserve core body temperature. Shivering is another response, where your muscles contract rapidly to generate heat, further aiding in maintaining your internal temperature. Heart rate and blood pressure also increase, further assisting in maintaining warmth. The cold triggers your sympathetic nervous system, which releases adrenaline and other stress hormones, causing your heart to pump faster and your blood vessels to constrict. The sudden change in temperature also activates the lymphatic system, which plays a crucial role in immune function. This activation helps to flush out toxins and improve circulation, enhancing your body's ability to fight off infections and diseases. Cold exposure can also stimulate the release of endorphins, hormones that have mood-boosting and pain-relieving effects. These natural chemicals can help reduce stress, improve your mood, and even alleviate pain, making you feel more invigorated and refreshed. These physiological responses are at the heart of the numerous benefits attributed to cold water therapy. From improved circulation and enhanced immune function to better mood and pain relief, the effects of cold exposure are profound and multifaceted. Embracing this practice can lead to a healthier, more resilient body and mind. Inflammation is a natural process that helps our bodies heal and fight infection. However, chronic, low-grade inflammation is linked to a wide range of health problems, including heart disease, arthritis, and even cancer. Cold water therapy has been shown to reduce inflammation throughout the body. The vasoconstriction caused by cold exposure helps to reduce blood flow to inflamed areas, limiting the delivery of inflammatory mediators. Additionally, cold water therapy can help to flush out metabolic byproducts that contribute to inflammation. Athletes have long used ice baths to help their bodies recover after intense workouts. The idea is that the cold water helps to reduce muscle soreness and inflammation, promoting faster recovery. While the research is somewhat mixed, there is evidence to suggest that cold water therapy can be beneficial for muscle recovery. Studies have shown that cold water immersion can reduce delayed onset muscle soreness, the pain and stiffness you feel in the days following a workout. The cold temperature helps to constrict blood vessels, reducing swelling and inflammation in muscle tissue. 5. Beyond the Physical – Cold Water and Your Brain Cold water therapy doesn't just benefit your body, it can also have a profound impact on your brain. The sensation of cold water hitting your skin can be shocking at first, but this initial discomfort is just the beginning of a cascade of positive effects that ripple through your entire nervous system. Exposing yourself to cold temperatures can enhance mood, improve focus, and even boost your resilience to stress. Imagine starting your day with a cold shower. The invigorating chill can wake you up more effectively than a cup of coffee, setting a positive tone for the rest of the day. This practice can also help you build mental toughness as you learn to embrace and adapt to the cold. The science behind these benefits lies in the complex interplay between the nervous system, hormones, and neurotransmitters. When you expose your body to cold water, it triggers a series of physiological responses designed to help you cope with the sudden change in temperature. These responses include the release of various chemicals in the brain that can improve your mental state. When you submerge yourself in cold water, your body releases a surge of norepinephrine, a neurotransmitter that plays a crucial role in attention, focus, and alertness. This release is part of your body's natural fight-or-flight response, which is activated by the cold. Norepinephrine helps to increase your heart rate and blood flow, preparing you to face any challenges that come your way. This surge of norepinephrine can leave you feeling energized, focused, and mentally sharp. 
Over time, regular exposure to cold water can train your brain to handle stress more effectively, making you more resilient in the face of everyday challenges. So the next time you find yourself hesitating to take that cold plunge, remember the myriad benefits it offers not just for your body, but for your mind as well. 6. Stress Reduction – Turning Down the Heat In today's fast-paced world, stress has become an unwelcome companion for many. Chronic stress can wreak havoc on both our mental and physical health. Cold water therapy offers a potent antidote to the detrimental effects of stress. Cold exposure activates the parasympathetic nervous system, our body's rest and digest system. This activation counteracts the fight-or-flight response triggered by stress, promoting relaxation and reducing anxiety levels. 7. Mental Clarity – Finding Your Focus in the Cold In our age of constant distractions, maintaining focus and concentration can feel like an uphill battle. Cold water therapy can be a surprisingly effective tool for enhancing cognitive function and mental clarity. The surge of norepinephrine triggered by cold exposure has been shown to improve attention span, working memory, and overall cognitive performance. Regular cold water immersion may even help to protect the brain against age-related cognitive decline. 8. No discussion of cold water therapy would be complete without mentioning Wim Hof, also known as the Iceman. Hoff is a Dutch extreme athlete renowned for his ability to withstand extreme cold using a combination of breathing techniques, meditation, and cold exposure. Hoff's methods have gained significant attention from the scientific community. Studies have shown that his techniques can indeed influence the autonomic nervous system and immune response, offering potential benefits for various health conditions. 9. Incorporating Cold Water Therapy Into Your Life you don't need to be an extreme athlete or dive into a freezing lake to reap the benefits of cold water therapy. Start gradually by incorporating cold showers into your daily routine. Begin with a short burst of cold water at the end of your regular shower and gradually increase the duration as you acclimate. You can also try cold water baths, starting with a few minutes and gradually increasing the time. Listen to your body and stop if you experience any discomfort or pain. 10. A word of caution. Safety first. While cold water therapy is generally safe for most people, it's essential to approach it with caution, especially if you have any underlying health conditions. Cold water immersion can be invigorating and beneficial, but it is not without its risks. Understanding these risks and taking appropriate measures can help you enjoy the benefits safely. Consult with your doctor before starting any new regimen particularly if you have heart disease, high blood pressure, or Raynaud's syndrome. Your doctor can provide personalized advice based on your medical history and current health status. They may recommend specific precautions or alternative therapies that are better suited to your needs. Always start slowly and gradually increase your exposure time. Begin with short durations and progressively extend the time as your body adapts. This gradual approach helps minimize the shock to your system and allows you to build tolerance safely. Pay attention to how your body responds and adjust accordingly. Avoid cold water immersion if you are pregnant, have a fever, or are under the influence of alcohol or drugs. These conditions can increase the risks associated with cold water exposure. Pregnant women should be particularly cautious, as the cold can affect both the mother and the developing baby. Similarly, alcohol and drugs can impair judgment and increase the likelihood of accidents. Listen to your body and never hesitate to stop if you feel unwell. It's crucial to recognize the signs of hypothermia, such as shivering, numbness, and confusion. If you experience any of these symptoms, exit the water immediately and seek warmth. Remember, the goal is to enhance your well-being, not to push your limits to the point of danger. Always prioritize your safety and well-being above all else.